of course you guys look amazing but the next thing i would say is that you guys have potential you have strong voices but the major problem i have was with your arrangement and harmonies of the song whoever put the harmonies together didn't give you guys the right harmonies for this song hi everyone my name is nikki laoye recording artist radio host humanitarian and entrepreneur and i am one of the judges for the lagos choir awards my name is femi olulowo also known as femi lowo I'm one of the judges of the Lagos Choir Awards. My name is Estelle Saji. I'm a guest judge at the Lagos Choir Awards. Hi guys, my name is Nathan Florocka Akiremi. I'm a judge at the Lagos Choir Awards. And trust me, this event is going to be eventful. Keep your eyes right here. Being a part of the Lagos Choir Awards has been a lot of fun, of course. Um, anything that has to do with, of course, uh, pushing forth um, a better picture and narrative of the gospel music industry and also getting to, you know, share a little bit of my wisdom and also see all the amazing choirs that have come on board. Um, I've seen the good, the bad and the funny. I don't want to say the ugly. So it's been a lot of fun actually being a part of this project and I, I, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing it through. Yeah, so it's been a lot of fun. My experience as a judge has been exciting. Hmm. Being a judge at the Lagos Choir Awards has been quite interesting because I have seen uh, numerous talents. It's been long since I've seen choirs with such colors and, you know, colors of sound and colors of, you know, um, costumes. I, I never knew MFM even had a, a team of singers, let alone guitar players. It, it's been beautiful, beautiful so far, so good. My word of advice, of course, uh, to the upcoming singers out there is that um, stay focused and be ready to evolve with the times and the sounds because the truth is music changes, uh, like the world is changing, things are happening in the world. You have to make sure that your music, your lyrics, your sounds are going with the times. You have to stay relevant with the message that is going across the world. You know, be a part of what is going on and let your music inspire and encourage others. So that basically should be at the back of your mind for every time that you're writing a song, for every time you're recording, for every time you're putting out music. Remember that it's all about inspiring, educating people out there. Yeah, what kind of judge would I say I am? Hmm. Uh, I am quite frank, honest, and brute. I'm a pure brute, you know. Um, my, my job is not, my, my character is not one to color or misconstrue my speech. The plan is to tell you as it is from my perspective, from perspective of a music producer, a singer, a songwriter and arranger. So I'm usually not so nice. You know, as you can see my face now, now I'm smiling. Rumor has it, I think you guys are the last group. So the Bible, you know, the Bible says you be the head and not. Uh, so you that you came in as the tail, you must not go out as the tail. <laughs> presentation was amazing there's no doubt about it you were on point with your voices your harmonies your um, choreography everything on point but remember it's a competition you need to bring something extra imagine taking a popular hip-hop song and turn it into this your oh, style Jesus. go and take one Kirk Franklin song and turn it into something like this oh my goodness then you will be like 
Oh, wow. Because it's a competition, you just have to do something out of the norm. Here you have it. This is how we wrap things up at the Lagos Choir Awards. Our judges have seen through all the talents, giving them honest criticism and feedback. Hopefully, these contestants will take the feedback given to them to work on themselves and bring forth their A-game if they make it to the next level of the competition. Who will make it to the next round? Hmm, could it be me? We'll find out in a bit. My name is Olive Emody. This is the Lagos Choir Awards. And stick around to find out what happens next.